Hallelujah. Hymn number 205. Jesus, keep me near the cross. That's our prayer. Can we be on our feet now? 205. Jesus, keep me near the cross. Everybody now. Jesus, keep me there. It's not just a song, it's a prayer. It's a prayer. A precious fountain. Free to all I Glory ever 
Ada composer, abide we say he Lead me, I'm rejoicing night and day. I'm rejoicing night and day as I walk the narrow way. For the comforter, for the comforter, say, Abba, say, say, he abides. Oh, he abides. He abides. He abides. Comforter, abide with me. Be alive, amen. He's alive. Oh, Jesus, Jesus is alive. Forever he's alive. Amen, amen. Oh, he's alive. He's, he's alive. He's alive. Jesus is alive. Forever is alive. Amen, amen, amen. He's alive. He's alive, amen. He's alive. Jesus is alive. Forever is alive. Amen. He's alive, amen. He's alive. Jesus is alive. Forever is alive, amen. Jesus Christ, the Son of God. Oh, yes, oh, yes. Okay, let's worship him now. Our glory to the Lamb who sits upon the throne. Okay, give him Sunday morning. He lives and reigneth forever. Sunday morning. He reigneth the majesty that is not like him. He's alive, he's alive and lives forever. We can be compared to you all, Lion of the tribe of Judah. We give you all. The glory we give you all the praise, oh Most High God. Give me worship, give me worship, give me worship. You will learn and worthy of all my praise. We deserve all the glory. We give you glory, we give you glory, we give you honor, cause you're worthy, Lord. What manner of man is Jesus? Hallelujah. Oh, what manner of man is Jesus? Jesus. Hallelujah. Oh. oh. What manner of man is Worshiping. Jesus? Hey. What manner of man is what manner of man is Jesus? Hey. Oh yes, uh, he made him that blind to see. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. What manner of man? What yes, manner of man is Jesus? Hey. Oh yes, he walked upon the sea. What manner of man is he? What manner of man is Jesus? Oh, what manner of man is Jesus? Eh? What manner of man is Jesus? Jesus is the sweetest oh, yes. name I know. He's always just the same. Oh, praise his holy name. That, that is, is the, the reason, reason why I love him so much. Jesus is the sweetest, the sweetest name I know. He's always just the same. Say the worship Jesus. You don't say worship Jesus. Worship me, worship me. You don't say the worship Jesus. Worship me, worship me.
Great is our God and greatly to be praised in the city of our God, in the mountain of His beautiful situation, beautiful for the joy of the whole world. The joy of the whole world. Oh, hallelujah. Great is our God. Great is our God. Great In the city of our God. In the mountain of His holy. Beautiful. The joy of the whole world. Is Mount Zion. Of the city of the great. He is Mount Zion, side of the northern city of the great king. Hosanna! Blessed be the Lord, let the rock of my salvation be exalted. Hosanna! 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 The rock of my salvation. Hosanna, say. Hosanna. Oh God, oh God. Be exalted. Hosanna. I will call upon the Lord Who is worthy to be praised I will magnify the Lord Who is worthy to be praised So shall I from my enemies, say, Oh, son, What a mighty God we serve! What a mighty God we serve! Let's worship the mighty God. Oh, yes. Heaven and earth adore Him. Angels bow before Him. What a mighty God we oh yes! What a mighty God we serve! What a mighty God. What a mighty God we serve! What a mighty God we serve! Angels bow before Him. What a mighty God we serve! He's a great God. That's who He is. He's a great God. He's a great, great God. That's all I know. That's all I know. He's a great God. That's all I know. All I know. He's great. He's great. He's great. Say. Sibel, as 
worship him. Open your mouth and tell him why you have been praising him this morning. Open your mouth and worship him. Express yourself to him. Express your heart to him. Tell him the reason why you have been worshiping him. Tell him because you know who he is. Tell him because you know. Know him to be the only true God. Express your heart to him. Because of who you are. Because of who you are. Express yourself to him. Express yourself to him. Between you and him. Tell him why you have decided to make him your God. Why is the God of Israel my God? Tell him, tell him. Worship you because of who you are. Without you, I am nothing. Without you, I am nothing. Yourself, express yourself to him. Express yourself to him. This is the reason I am worshiping you. This is the reason I will continue to worship you for the rest of my life. Tell him, tell him. your maker it is because you don't know who he is and every day he manifests himself to let you as an individual know who he is when you travel and after you arrive you hear or you even see along the road accidents when you hear the story of how some accidents take place when you go to the emergency what? Emergency section of any hospital. 
then you will see the grace of God in your life. When you read stories, funny, funny things that are going on around the world, then you will see the special love of God. That alone should activate worship in you. That's all he needs from us. To do something or say something. I said do something and say something. To let him know that you appreciate him. That is the meaning of worship. You are Alpha and Omega. We worship you, our God. until you have made the God of Israel you are all and all. That is the kind of person that can enjoy fellowship with the Holy Ghost. He's your all and all. You are Alpha and Omega. That's how we worship you. We God and worship him. We worship you. You are Lord and one Lord. You Give him glory. Give him glory. Oh, we give him glory. Give Whoa! 
worthy. One more time. You are worthy, Jesus. You are worthy. One more time. Oh, we give you. By the depth of your heart. You by the depth of your heart. Oh, we give you all the glory. glory. We oh, give you all the glory. glory. It all belongs to you, Jesus. Take it, Lord. 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 Just open your mouth. Give your mouth and say, 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 say. Just open your mouth and give him all the glory. Just open your mouth and give him all the glory. For where I am today, I give you all the glory. For where I am today, I give you all the glory. Open your mouth and give him all the glory for divine health. For keeping me alive, I give you all the glory. Give him all the glory. Give him all the glory. Give him all the glory. For where I am today, I give you all the glory. Open your mouth. Give him all the glory for your life. For this job you have given me that I am doing now, I give you all the glory. Oh, yes. Give him all the glory. You have any reason? Give him all the glory. In Jesus' name, we worship. There is none like him. It's none like the God of Israel. He's a dependable God. He's a reliable God. He's a merciful God. He's a faithful God. When you hold on to him, he will not let you fall. When you depend on him, you will not be ashamed. He's the mighty one in battle. He has never lost any battle. That's why we are here this morning to worship you, Lord. That's why we are here to worship you, Papa. Search our hearts. We don't have enough words to express our gratitude, Lord. We don't have enough words to express worship to you. When we look at all the dangers around us, despite all our carnality, you have given us a goshe. You are worthy, Lord. You are worthy, Lord. You are worthy, Lord. You are worthy, Lord. You are worthy. You are worthy, Lord. Oh, yes. You are worthy, Lord. It's worthy of our praise. You are worthy, Lord. You are worthy, Lord. Somebody here, you don't know why all your friends are forsaking you. It is because God does not want to share his glory with any man concerning you. They have forsaken you. God allow it so that when he will lift you up, Nobody will say it's because of me. Oh, glory must be to the Lord. For he is, for he is, for he is worthy of my grace. Let no man, no man, Lord, should give glory. any frustration? No, it's not a frustration. God wants to repackage you in a special way. 
There's something I'm seeing. That's why I'm making this statement. God wants to repackage you. They have forsaken you. I'm talking to somebody. You are standing like in an island. No help. No help. Okay, no. Not an island. Desert. Here, nothing. Here, nothing. Here, nothing. Here, nothing. You are standing in a desert alone. As if you have been forsaken. No, he has not forsaken you. He's about to give you a testimony. When he lifts you out of that wilderness, you will know that there is a God that loves you. Miracle worker. You are a miracle worker. Come and do a miracle. A miracle today. Come and do a miracle. A miracle. Destiny changer. Your name is Destiny Changer. That's who he is. You are a destiny changer. Come and change your destiny. Come and change our destiny. A destiny today. Come and change your destiny. Destiny today. Come and change our destiny. Let's call his name. Destiny today. Your name is Jesus. Your name is Jesus. Powerful worker. Your name is Jesus. Jesus. Jesus is your, your name. name is Jesus. You are a destiny changing oh, God. You are a destiny changing God. Your name is Jesus. Say, 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 say. say your name is Jesus. Jesus. Your name is Jesus. Jesus. You are a destiny changer. Call that name. The name is of every other name. You are, yes, you are. You, you are. are a miracle walking God. One more time. Say, say, oh, say. Oh, your name is Jesus. Jesus. You are a miracle walking God. You are. Your name is Jesus. Anytime you call upon God and it looks as if he has forsaken you, let me tell you what is happening. He has not forsaken you. He has kept you there and he has gone to look for the materials. He's gathering the materials. He can never forsake you. He can never forsake his own. Hallelujah. What testimony do you want to have this week? See, let God show himself that he loves you. Let God confirm that he has not forsaken you. Okay, take that prayer point. Lord, confirm to me you have not forsaken me. Open your mouth and pray now. Confirm, confirm, confirm to me what this pastor is saying is true, that you have not forsaken me. Just what he says, he will do. He's gonna fulfill every promise to you. Don't give up on that, cause he won't give up on you. He's able. Yes, he Confirm is. to me that yeah, you have not forsaken me, Papa. Yes, he is. Yes, he's able. Say, God is. God is able to. Just what to say is. Just what he is. He's going to fulfill.
Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Now let me tell you, God wants to confirm something for somebody. Now just be in the spirit. The disciples, when they were tormenting them everywhere, they said that you will stretch forth your hands. That was their prayer. Stretch forth your hand. Another place. He said, this thing that you say happening is by the finger of God. When God touches you, hallelujah, you never remain the same. When he touches your womb, no other hand can touch that womb. When God touches your business, nothing can disturb that business. Somebody here, when God touches your life, something happens. Place your hand on your chest. Touch me one more time. Oh Lord. Be ready for that touch here now. Touch me now. Touch me one more time. Oh Lord. Oh, I need a touch from the master. I need a touch from the Lord. Oh, touch me one more time. Oh, Lord. No, no, don't sing this song because you like the song. Sing the song because of what the song is saying. Therefore, when you say, touch me, let your mind go to the area you want God to touch. If you are sick, then let the Lord touch you, touch your body. Uh -uh. Thank you, Lord. You're being the spirit. You're being the spirit. You're being the spirit. Who is this Lord? Who is this Lord? You can't be in this type of bondage. I'm seeing somebody. Maybe you're coming here for the first time. You're not part of this revival that is going on. This is a restoration ministry. Ah, Father, restore somebody here today, 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 today. like water is inside that cup. They are stretching this cup to give somebody. And you are stretching your hand. When you are about to get to that cup, the cup will shift back. Uh -uh. You are about to collect it, the cup will shift back. Ah, Father, who is this person? The hand that has been withdrawing your blessing from you, that hand shall be cut off today in the name of Jesus. Yeah. Who is this Lord? Your cup of blessing. Your cup of. Who is this Lord? Your cup of blessing. Satan is a liar. Your blessing that they have been withholding from you. Today, I release it to you in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and claim it. Claim that cup. All my blessing. Claim it. Open your mouth and claim it. The Lord is releasing something to you. And the enemy is withdrawing it from you. I claim my blessing. I claim my breakthrough. I claim it. I claim it all. Claim it. Receive it. Collect it by force. Collect it. Claim it, oh. Claim it. Receive it. Claim it, oh. Claim it. Claim it. Claim it. I claim my cup of blessing. I claim my cup of blessing. I claim my cup of blessing. I claim it or claim it.
claim that fruit of the womb you have been looking for. So that that miscarriage will stop. Claim that employment letter you have been waiting for. So that the delay will stop. Claim it now. Claim that marriage you have been waiting for. So that there will be no delay again. Claim that document you have been looking for overseas. Claim it, claim your papers, claim it, claim your papers. They have been delaying, delaying, claim it. He has come to release it to you now, 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 now. Claim that deliverance you have been expecting. Deliverance from demo husband. Deliverance from demo wife. Claim the deliverance now. Claim that connection you have been looking for. Claim that connection, claim it. Claim it, claim it. Claim your healing, claim your healing. Claim that favor you have been expecting. In Jesus' name we worship. I don't even know what I want to talk before that revelation came forth. What would your pressure? What are you believing God for? Satan is a liar. Satan, 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 you are a liar. All the blessings that God has released for us, they shall manifest. For it is written that our expectation shall not be cut off. You are, whatever you are expecting, it shall manifest speedily in the name of Jesus. What do you want the Lord to do for you this week? Be very specific. Between now and next Sunday, what testimony do you want to have? I'm going to give you three minutes to tell the Lord. How will I know that I came here and met with you? It is from my testimony I will know. How will I know you touched me? It is from my testimony. When I live here, the testimony that we follow, we confirm, Father, that you have touched me. Let this be my testimony. Are you going for an interview? Let the success be the evidence you met with him here. Oh, yes. You believe in God for the fruit of the womb? And maybe this week. Okay. Let it be this week. Thank you, Father. Let it be this week. Between now and next Sunday, grant my heart desire, Lord. I need a visitation between now and next Sunday. Sunday. Within three minutes, tell him what testimony do you want to have because you came here today. Open your mouth and begin to talk to him now. It's between you and God now. Will I come to your presence and go back empty handed? No, you are a merciful God. The blessings you have some people here pass me not. your blessing today, Lord. Thou the spring of all my call, comfort more than to me. Whom have I on earth beside you, Lord? Whom have I on earth beside I give. Whom in heaven for thee, oh my Savior, 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 yes.
In Jesus' name we pray. If you can answer me a faith-filled amen now, whatever is your heart desire, it is granted in the name of Jesus Christ. I say whatever is your heart desire. People don't know how to receive something. Let me tell you. If you were having waist pain that you could not stand, and then you have been praying, you sat down there praying, Lord, heal me. Lord, heal me of this waist pain. Lord, heal me of this stomach pain. The pain that could not make you stand. And I say, your heart desire has been granted. Now, it's not, you, you, you cannot sit down there and say, Amen. And you are still sitting down there. You are just saying a religious amen, not a faith-filled amen. Faith-filled amen will say amen with anger and shake that thing away. That's how it is. When I say grant your heart desire and you told your, your, your boss is holding your blessing and you want to approach him tomorrow, when you will say amen, your mind will go to that man. The amen will flow and hit him. Any condition you want to change, when I stand like this at the altar, after worshiping God like this, his presence is here. All he wants to hear from you is amen, then it will connect to what I say. And if I'm a true servant of God, he says he will not let the word of his servant fall to the ground. He confirms it. But I need your amen. The amen, not with mouth, just mouth, from the heart. And something will happen. Now, I want to make that pronouncement again. Whatever is your heart desire that you said the Lord should do to you, do for you, between now and that Sunday, that which you have asked him to do, I say it has been granted in the name of Jesus. <laughs> Receive your heart desire in the name of Jesus Christ.
Somebody here, receive your healing in the name of Jesus Christ. Somebody here, receive your breakthrough in the name of Jesus Christ. That favor you are going for, receive it in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Jesus. Can we clap our hands for our God? It's done. Tell your neighbor, by next Sunday, you will not recognize me. By next Sunday, by, by next Sunday, you will not recognize me.